it's Rachel and welcome back to Looking for Adventure Art and today is the start of our Shop Hop series or in the case of SMS, the shop that did not hop but it doesn't matter because it was awesome and we had a blast as always. This is my first vlog ever so I do want to apologize. Some of the audio ends up being a little hard to hear. I was not able to get the audio that I thought I got because people were a little noisy but that's because we were all having fun. So I do apologize for that in advance but hopefully you're still able to hear enough of it and at least see how awesome it is. We got there at 2.10 in the morning if you can believe that and it was dark and we were first in line and it got a little sketchy for a while but it was awesome and I love hanging out with all my friends in line that I see every single year. They are the best so it's so much fun. I absolutely love it. I did want to show you guys a few things that I got at the shop that did not hop that were not in the video. We got this which is some really really cute stickers. I think that this is some of the coolest stuff and mine just happened to say happy birthday which was totally appropriate because this is the way that I always kick off my birthday every year. And then we got this really cute sort of sentiment set that's already pre die cut and the sentiments are foiled so really awesome. I absolutely loved it. You guys would be very proud of me. I spent almost no money there. I was good because I am saving up to buy a bunch of things for the thousand subscriber giveaway when it comes. But I couldn't resist. I of course had to get some stuff, especially because they have such an amazing free gift for the first 2000 people in store and online. That gift is this. Now this probably doesn't look like much. I do have a photo and I will include it up there, but it is a really cute mini sort of scrapbook page layout and it is in the theme of the shop hop for them this year, the shop that did not hop, which is Phantom of the Opera. I was so excited. Stacy looked amazing. They did like a custom organ. It was it was fantastic. I, I think she went above and beyond this year. I was so impressed and I am such a theater geek, so it was awesome. I just, I can't get enough of it. I will definitely have to probably go back before the end of the shop hop. But I think that this is really cool. It comes with their very own custom Tonic Studios Nouveau Glitter, which is in Phantom Gray for their Phantom of the Opera theme. And also in here somewhere, in addition to, they have this super cute custom pin. So it says Scrapbooking Made Simple, the shop that did not hop 2016 with the little Phantom of the Opera symbol. And they've got all the pieces for the layout, but it also comes with a chandelier die and stamp, and it is gorgeous. And I mean gorgeous. People were making earrings out of them. They were they were so pretty. So I think that this is awesome. She really outdid herself this year. She always sits and makes custom gifts for us throughout the shop hop. So last year we had some really cute butterfly hair clips, but this year she decided to use the brand new Tonic Studios jewelry dies, which she took the the tiny bracelet die and actually turned it into a keychain which is so cute and then she used her last release which is I think flower shop or the one right after that and she used her butterfly dies and she used some watercolor pencils on the paper leather from Sizzix which does not tear and made these super cute butterfly keychains for us. I think they're absolutely adorable. We got to pick our colors of butterfly. We got to pick our colors for the keychain. She is amazing. I can't believe that she sits there and does so many of these all day. I got this awesome embossing folder and it is just in the United States. It's from Sizzix. It's normally I think five or six dollars and I got it for about two dollars. 250 I think so it's a great deal she in addition to the shop that does not hop does the Sizzix warehouse sale so the entire back room is filled with Sizzix products at like mind-blowing deals and the longer you wait the better deal you get but you might not get your pick because we tend to grab everything as fast as we possibly can so I picked this up in particular because to anybody that sends me a thank you card or uh, a drawing or anything I will be sending back in addition to my thank you card with the wax seal a cute little special thing using this embossing folder. I got these really cool art bins. Now these art bins are normally about $20 and they were on sale at the back part of the store for $5 and they're perfect for holding paper and in addition to that 
Woo. They come with these cute little trays so you, they can hold your little cute cat eye, you know, uh, inks or any other small inks that will fit. And it also comes with this tray and they are removable. So I'm planning on removing them and using them on my desk as separate storage and putting my paper in here. So I got two of those. But other than that, I was really good. I did not get anything else. So I hope that you enjoy the vlog of the shop that did not hop. And let me know in the comments down below what you guys specifically want to see in the upcoming shop hop videos. Is there anything in particular that you want to know about that you would like me to ask questions for or try and get more information on? Hey adventures, it's Rachel and welcome back to Looking for Adventure Art. And today I have been standing in line since gosh, like 2, 10 a.m. for the shop that did not hop at SMS, also known as Scrapbooking Made Simple. And right now it is 6.44 and I am finally having some breakfast. Mom is running the camera because my boyfriend is at work, but it should be a ton of fun today. So hopefully I'll be able to take some vlogs of us in line. It's already getting really loud and busy, so I don't know if I'll be able to do that. And hopefully I'll be able to also get some inside shots. If not, I will at least try and take photos and and possibly an interview with Stacy, so we will see. But the line is already starting to get really, really long, even though it's so early in the morning. So only a few more hours till the shop finally opens. I will check back in with you guys really, really soon. Hey, Avengers, it's Rachel. So I am sitting and waiting in line. They just put out the sign for the front of the shop, and the line has gotten huge. I'm hopefully going to take some of uh, videos of all that but they just came around with their very first freebies so I got these really cute die cut flowers along with some awesome litter tools so these are our first two gifts they'll probably come around every half hour to maybe 10 minutes it depends and uh, I'll show you guys some more so I'll check back in with you but we only have an hour to go before the shop opens so yay Okay guys, so they came around right now. It is 8.21 and the last gift that they did was about 8.04. So they just came around and this is what my mom got, some really cool 3D embossed stickers. And this is what I got, some really cool Halloween stickers. So I am super excited. They'll probably come around really soon. They showed us some of the really cool free gifts that they have for us. And we're super duper close to finally having it be open. And I cannot wait, I'm so excited. And I'm I'm gonna hopefully do my best to try and video everything that's going on in the store. So I'll be back soon. scrapbooking made simple with the shop that did not hop and it was so much fun and it is gorgeous Stacy's outfit looks amazing she made all these cute little custom butterfly keychains using the new Sizzix dies for jewelry it was awesome the place was totally packed and we got some really awesome free layouts we got a really cute pin we got some more free stuff when we were standing in line at checkout I was really good I did not buy as much as I thought I would so a thumbs up for me 
And even though you guys are probably watching this from out of state, there is still 17 days, well now 16 more days, for you to come and check it out. It ends on the 31st of July, so come down, come buy stuff. If you can't come down, you can definitely order online. They are doing some freebies and online orders. Just remember, it ships when it ships. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for all the daily updates. And if you happen to make anything that you had bought from Scrapbooking Made Simple or just in general, please tag me on Facebook or Instagram or Twitter or whatever kind of social media this that you guys do. I want to see it. And don't forget, every day is a new adventure, so come back next time for a new adventure with us.